All right, here we are. You know, I, I came home. It was a, what do you call it? A hard day at work. I'm burning up. My skin is uh, nine shades darker than it used to be. But that's not why we're here. We're here to talk about this video game that's coming out. A video game that's part four of one of my favorite, um, one of my favorite um, beloved video game series it looks like it's uh the fourth canonical uh you know chapter in the crash bandicoot lore um crash bandicoot 3 coming out in 1998 way back then it was uh, it was a great game one of the best games ever made i played the remastered version had fun and yeah, you, you get to jump on the polar bear to get some, uh, I think you get like a free guy or something. I can't remember what, but yeah, you jump at the polar bear and you get, you get a prize. You get a jet pack, you get to ride a motorcycle. It's pretty fun. I don't know what's in store for this one. This is my first time watching. I would have watched it on my big screen. But I wanted to share this with you guys, I guess. You know, I thought, why well, haven't done a trailer in a while? Why well, I did what I did a trailer um, what last week, but yeah, I, I'm being pretty lazy lately. I've been doing much shit, so I'm doing this. I gotta take my headphones off. It sounds really. Uh, I could listen to myself, and it just sounds nuts. You know, I'm still still getting used to that shit. You know, uh, listening. It's like an echo. And I thought it was fucked up. I actually recorded a little bit before this, but I had to make sure that it was working. But it seems to be working all right. But um, without wasting further time, let's just go ahead and get this out the way. I'm excited. I was told about this through Fozzie Bear, Josh Fazzo, uh, not Josh Milan, at work. So uh, he, told, he said, hey, have you seen the new Crash Bandicoot 4 trailer? I was like, no. No, I haven't. What are you talking about? And he, uh, yeah, so, anyway, fuck that. I'm gonna shut the fuck up and, uh, let's just do this. Crash Bandicoot. Oh, shit. You banished me to the past. The past? But all it did was give me more time to plan your doom. doom, doom. <laughs> it's still a big head. Oh, fuck. Oh, whoa. Look at him go. He looks different. New powers, new masks. Oh shit! What's he doing? <laughs> oh man! It's like, oh wait, you get you play as Neo. You get to play as Coco. Look at her go. Yeah, she looked really fast. Oh shit, you got get big. Oh fuck. He drums now? He has selfies. Wall running. Oh man. Oh wow. October second. How many times have you beaten this clown anyway? Three. Really? Only three? <laughs> Funny. Seemed like more. Ooh, did you hear that? That's like, oh God, you can't even see the, you can't even see his outfit. You got the little fuck thing in the way. Oh, well, I'm sure it looks okay. Coco looks cool. All right, right off the bat, I got to say, it doesn't look as cool as the, the, the racing game. I'm playing the racing game right now. I gotta unlock his girlfriend, the the tall girl, Tana, and she's pretty hot. And yeah, they give him they give him more fur. Everyone looks like not realistic, but this one looks it looks cartoony. And I'm looking on the bottom here, and sure enough, it is PS4. Uh see, it's not quite PS5. I was hoping it'd be on the Wretched and Clank uh, tier of uh, PS5 craziness, but whatever 
it's it's coming out in October, so of course, obviously, the PS5 won't be out yet. Something else is coming out October second. I can't remember. Um, yeah, stuff coming out. Uh, I'll probably play it. You know, uh, buy it digitally, digital, digitally. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, Wrath of Cortex came out uh, after Part 3. But I tried to play that one. And you know what? I couldn't. Because it wasn't because it was hard. It wasn't because it sucked. It was actually cool. But the loading times. Dude, I swear to God. The loading times for each level were like five minutes long each. It was really stupid. Um, I don't know why they released that game. It was... It really, like, there's games with long loading times, and it usually gives you, like, stuff to do. But that one, oof. Oof. So, yeah, they, they kind of stylized them a little bit. Let's see if we can get a good shot of, uh... Oh, he's, like, uh, doing something... Yeah, he like um he doesn't look too different. I mean, what do you expect, you know? He's, you got Neocortex, you got Coco. Um you know, you look at Coco and you ask, "Would you? Would you? Or would you like look, look, look at that strap hanging off. It's got one shoulder." All right, Coco, I know what you're thinking about. All right. I'm down. So, uh she can do some stuff. In the um, the remake, with parts one, two, and three, you could play as Coco. Now, if I like Coco anymore, and maybe I do now, uh, she has her own little attacks. Instead of uh, spinning, she she still spins, but she like hits you with your laptop. You know, she's got her little laptop because she's a nerd, and you get this little uh, amplitude uh, guitar hero looking stage. Got Dr. Engine. Apparently he could drum now. Apparently he can uh Apparently he can he's got the sticks. Oh okay. Now I saw a gif of this. He's taking a selfie. And I didn't know he had a phone in his hand, but it looks like he could if you look in very close, he's got a um he's got a phone, so it's all good. He's wall running. I'm hoping this game is like uh like forty bucks. It doesn't look like a big time sixty dollar game, but you know it's about time. You know it it is about time to to get another crash game. And who knows, maybe when they um does it say who makes it? Like what's the what's the company or whatever? Crash Bandicoot is this what's called? Toys for Bob? Activision? Activision presents! It's not Beanox, is it? Because Beanox made the racing game. They made that game look cool. God, no. Beanox is making another game. I don't know, man. I I'm, I'm so off the loop with these games. Can I get rid of the fucking ad? I want to see what Crash looks like. Where's the... There's like a hidden... There's usually a hidden X somewhere. I guess not. But yeah, you know, you got the Funk Soul Brothers song playing. Reminding you of the 90s. He's got feet on the soul. Okay, okay. Okay, Crash. Alright, well, yeah, it looks fun. Looks like a good time. So I'm, at, I'm hitting 10 minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and cut it out now. But... Yeah, I'll play it. I don't know if I'll buy it, but I probably will. Who knows? I might be banking by October. I swear to God, there's something else uh, for October 2nd. I can't remember what. There's all, there's all kinds of shit coming out. So. Maybe I'm thinking of... Um, I don't Never mind. Forget it. I'm just going to keep thinking and... Um, that's it, guys. Um, 
I'll try to make a podcast soon about the Avatar. I saw the Avatar movie. Not the movie, the fuck, 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 the show. I saw the show. The first season. Uh, so uh, I'll, I'll do that. I've just been slacking. I've been playing, I've been playing Hitman. And uh, they're making a part three. I'm excited. So yeah, maybe I'll, uh, fuck, I'm in the mood, you know. I'm going to play some uh, Crash Team Racing. Try to unlock his girlfriend, you know, Tani. Tana. Because, I mean, if I had to choose between Tana and Coco, I'm, you know, I'm sorry, Coco. I'm going to have to go with the tall one with the legs. You know, it's just... Oh, ew. Alan, calm down. Jesus. Take a cold shower. All right. Enough of that perv shit. Uh, if there's another trailer out there, maybe I'll check it out. I'll just keep doing these things until... uh. We all catch COVID, and you know we, we just got no choice. We're just gonna watch uh, cartoons. So yeah, keep on keeping on. Long days and pleasant nights. Don't drink and drive, and you know all that good shit. Bye.